What is going on? Sleepy Slurbro here, and welcome back to the next episode, I think episode 52 of the Pokemon Liquid Crystal Nuzlocke. This episode, we will be trying to attempt to catch this Latias and explore what else there is of the Seafoam Islands, if there's any more of the Seafoam Islands. Seafoam Islands. And one thing I realized from the last two recordings, I forgot to do a team recap. In both of them, I'm pretty sure. Maybe not the first one, I don't remember. Last one I, I cut. Last episode I completely forgot to do a team recap, so we're gonna do one now. We got Batgirl here, the Crobat with Fly, Poison Fang, Confuse Ray, and Bite. We got Snappy the Froligator with Surf, Ice Punch, Bite, and Slash. We got Ocelot the Suicune with Aurora Beam, Bubble Beam, Rain Dance, and Waterfall. We got Raquel the Golem with Rock Blast, Strength, Fire Punch, and Earthquake. We got EJ the Latios with Fire, uh, Psychic, Dragon Breath, Recover, and Dive. And we got Skinwalker the Gengar with Shadow Punch, Dream Eater, Destiny Bond, and Shadow Ball. So that's the team we're working with today. We're going to attempt to catch this Latios. And question of the day. Alright, no, never mind. The question of the day is, if you were to create a new typing, what would it be? I have a little story about this very quick. When I was in 4th grade, in like X and Y, or was I, I was in 6th, 5th grade, I think. And X and Y were being announced, and the new typing was being announced. And all my friends thought it was going to be a light type. Like, for example... Yveltal is a dark and flying type, and Xerneas was going to be a grass and light type, and they counter each other out, you know? But it turns out it was fairy type, and at first I was like, eh, fairy types, but then I was like, and then soon I've learned to love fairy types, I love them, and yeah. What's your favorite, uh, you know, if you were to create a new type, what would you pick? I would pick a light type, like, to counteract dark. So yeah, that's the question of the day, and without, without further ado, let's try to catch this, uh, Latias, Latias. It is time, boys, it is time! Look at that, girl, look at that. Mm. Just took a sip of water there. Look at that majestic girl. All right, time to go for a surf. A surf should not kill, I don't think. If a surf kills, it doesn't even deserve to be on the team. Psychic, how much will this do? Ooh, that did that that did some damage. Let's use another surf. Charm. You lowered my attack twice. All right. Let's go for one more. And uh, I really want to hit it again, but I, at the same time, I really don't. So who else could take a hit? Maybe Ocelot. Mist Ball. Um, ooh, Mist Ball. All right. So let's go to our Pokeballs and let's throw, chuck a couple Great Balls. I know you're red, and you must not like Great Balls, but I mean, you just gotta stay in the ball, Latias. Just stay in the ball. Just stay in the ball, Latias. Come on, it's a Great Ball. It means you're great. Oh, and it didn't Ugh, So close. Bug type, repeat ball. Let's use a repeat ball, because why not? Honestly, just why not? All right, let's see if it works. And it just didn't work at all. All right, cool. Miss ball lowers my special attack. Let's go for another great ball. Come on, stay in the ball. Come on, Ladia, see you. Nope. That was a pure accident. And the Ladios is gone. Ah, oh, that that ah, that stung. I promise, that was a pure accident, and I I don't know. Ah, well, that's gone. That Ladios is gone. Long gone. It could have been a potential team member, now it's not. Is there anything behind here? Nope, it's not. I just was an idiot and I pressed the RAN button. Ugh. But let's put that in the past and keep moving forward, because I'm not going to get the Latias back. Most likely not. And there's also a few more legendaries I can get. I didn't want to chuck the Master Ball, because I know there's a lot more legendaries I can potentially get, and I already have a powerful Dragon Psychic type on the team, being Latios, EJ, and yeah. That's pretty much- well, that's over. That was over fast. That- I, I meant- what I meant to- I didn't mean to press- I was so mad at myself about that, but I mean, you know. Wait, is there any more we can explore? Let me- let me just check out the- the quick map, and wait. Fusion City. Seafoam Islands. I don't think- is that it? If that's it, then we're gonna go to Cinnabar, uh, to Meridian City and Battle Blue right now. Damn! Wait, where's Articuno then? No, Articuno must be around here somewhere. No, Articuno's in... Because isn't, isn't Articuno in the Seafoam Islands? Well, it's probably not. Alright, let's go. Let's actually... You know what? You know what we're gonna do today? 
series has been going on for a while, but now we're gonna do the ultimate challenge. We are going to battle Blue. And this might be a, this is gonna be a rough battle. A very rough battle at that, so. Ah, uh, so all right, all right. Gengar, you get out here. You stay in the box while, mm, which I add to the team. These, mm, Golem maybe? Mm. You might have an electric type, so I send Meganium to the team, and I think this is the team we're rolling with. We're gonna take Gengar out, slap Meganium on the team, and we're gonna go battle Blue. The ultimate gym leader, the very brief champion of the of the Pokemon League before Red very quickly overtake him. Overtook him, I should say. Let's lead off with our boy Snappy and let's get on with it. Yo, jump in the making, how's it going? Looks like you're on a roll. The gym leader is the guy who battled the champion three years ago. He's no pushover. Give it everything you've got. I I shall. I that's that's what I intend to do. Blue. Listen to me, Blue. You're gonna be a tough battle, but you are the last gym leader of Kanto. Let's get some hype! Let's go. Yo, you finally got here, huh? I wasn't in the mood at Cinnabar, but now I am. You ready to battle? You're telling me you conquered all the gyms in Johto? Hey, Johto gyms must be pretty pathetic, then. <laughs> hey, don't worry about it. You don't talk. You don't talk smack about my my home region, boy. Boy. Oh, you're you're gonna get it now. You're talking smack about Johto. I'll know if you're good or not by battling you right now. Ready, Johto champ? Dude, I'm the champion of Johto, and you're dissing me. Are, are you serious, Blue? Are you serious? Oh, six on six battle. Let's go. Let's go. Pidgeot. Ooh, all right. All right, you send in the Pidgeot. That's understandable. I understand why you would do that. Let's go for an ice punch, though. Did you expect this? Very brief champion of the Johto region. Did you expect that? What do you have? Mirror move. Oh. Oh, Ice Punch. Let's see how much this does. Let's see how much this does. Oh, look at that damage, man. Oh, you, you really you got me on the ropes, man. You honestly got me on the ropes. And you know what's beautiful about this? You're right out, out of the range of healing. Like, I, I think, like, from all the Pokemon games I've played, that they don't heal. They they heal at red or very close to red. Like, like, yellow, but, like, very close to red yellow. But, like, when they're past, like, when they're, like, beginning yellow... I probably explain this really badly, but yeah, I kind of learned when like they like uh, when they heal up. Executor, Charizard would have been very useful actually. But anyway, let's go into Batgirl and let's go for that big fat fly and let's. Oh, actually, you're part Psychic type. What am I doing? But I believe in Batgirl. Let's go for Fly. Let's see how much this does. Oh, you're going, for, you're going for Solar Beam? Are you serious? Did that? I'm quad resistant to Solar Beam. Hit you, Solar Beam, how much will this do? I'm quad resistant, I'm a poison and flying type. Blue, do you know your typings? Do you know what, do you, do you know that, uh, what was it? Grass is not very effective against uh, poison and flying, so I'm quad resistant. Uh, Blue? Ooh, oh, it's a critical hit! So epic, uh, my poison type just took out your psychic type. This is so epic. Alakazam, ooh, Alakazam. Let's go into Snappy because he's our, he's the only one in our entire uh, usable Mons who has a Dark type move. This might be a problem. This might be. Who knows? Oh, the sun's up too. That's that's really annoying. But we're gonna go for Bite, disable, but it failed. Oh, looks like outspeeding didn't really get. Oh, oh. Looks like outspeeding didn't really help you there. That's what I meant to say. And. Uh, you're dead. Are you gonna go for disable now? No, you're gonna go for a full restore. All right, cool. That's fine. I am fine with that. Ooh, because your defenses are garbage, Alakazam. Let's go for another slash. You go for psychic. How much is it gonna do? This might do a decent chunk. That did a very decent chunk, but this should take it out. Goodbye, Alakazam. See you later. How many? How many? Uh, eh, how many Pokemon have we taken out already? Let's let's find out. Right on. Right on. Let's go into Stego Plant because let's give some Stego. Let's give Stego Plant some time to shine. He has three more Mons left. All right, cool. The sunlight faded. Aw. Oh well. Let's go for Giga Drain because this, uh, I'm pretty sure Rhydon's a lot more uh, physically defensive than specially. 
Let's go for that, and we take it out in one hit. Dude, but the levels are, are jumping, though. Like, this game, like I said in the last episode, it's not getting any easier. Or not, yeah. Arcanine! Ooh, alright, cool. Classic blue mon, classic blue or Gary mon. Let's go into Golem. Let's get some Golem some time to shine, too. Golem has been a very important part of the series, a long-time team member. A very long-time team member, I should say. We had him since we were... I think we've had Rock House since she was a Geodude. Anyway, let's go for Earthquake. This is Stab. 100 base power. And you are an Arcanine. With decent... Arcanine's a great mon, actually. Alright, let's go. He goes for Roar. And you send out Crobat. Very interesting choice. Or, yeah, it's random. Let's go for Fly, though. And what are you gonna do? Flamethrower. It misses because I am in the air. And you go for Extreme Speed. And that also misses. Oof. Oof, Blue, you don't you don't know how to battle. If you were to gone for a, if you were to go for a regular type move, you would have hit me, and that probably would have it would, probably wouldn't have taken out my crowbat, but it would it would have done a very uh, tremendous amount. All right, mm -hmm. Gyarados. Let's go into Snappy. I would go into Ocelot, but uh, what was it? Ocelot. All its moves are uh, not very effective against the Gyarados, but we have our boy Snappy with Bite and Slash, which will do a decent amount. And he, actually, let's, let's go into, into Ocelot, Hyper Beam, and let's go back into Snappy so we can get rid of that Intimidate. Must recharge, let's go for Slash, Twister. Hmm, Twister, it doesn't do very much, doesn't do very much. Max Potion. Let's hit that fat Max Potion, and let's go for Bite. Let's recharge, let's go for Slash, a critical hit, and you go for Twister. You gonna heal? You gonna heal? Oh, this is annoying. I'm gonna speed this up a tiny bit just because it's annoying and ooh, that hyper beam though. Oh we can go we can go for one more slash because you Oh Oh that crit though. I didn't expect even a crit to kill. Leader Blue was defeated. What? How the heck did I lose to you? Alright, here, take it. It's the Earth badge. Ladies and gentlemen. We got the Earth Badge, the final badge of Kanto. This is so epic. All right, all right. I was wrong. You're you're, you're the real deal. Earth Badge the, enables the uh, use of dive outside of battle. You're a good trainer. But I'm going to beat you someday, and you don't forget it. You're gonna beat me, huh? Cause you may not lose till I beat you. Got it? Well, it looks like we beat him. So right before this episode ends, how long have I been recording for? 15 minutes, all right, cool, very nice, very nice. I'm gonna visit our boy, the home slice, Professor Oak. He, didn't he say if I got all eight gym badges, he had a present for me? I'm pretty sure that's what he said. Hopefully that's what he said. All right, let's go down here. Let's visit the boy, Professor Oak, and let's let's get receive our prize. Wow, that's excellent. You collected the badges of gyms of Kanto. Well done. I was, uh, I was right in my assessment of you. Tell you what, Sleepy, I'll make arrangements so that you can go to Mount Silver. Mount Silver is a big mount that is home to many wild Pokemon. It's too dangerous for your average trainer, so it's off limits. But we can make an exception for in your case, yeah. 16 badges, boy. 16! <laughs> I was gonna swear there, but I'm not going to swear. I am not going to swear. Uh, so we got 16 badges. Uh, go up to the Indigo Plateau and you can reach Mount Silver from there. The amount of progress you made in the Pokedex is. Wow. Oh ho, this Pokemon, uh, this is turning into a quite a respectable Pokedex. Te Pokedex. Your national decks is. I'll be looking forward to seeing you fill your national decks. So before we do that, we have a little bit more time this episode. Next episode, we're going to explore Mount Silver, but there's, uh, there's, uh, I'm probably going to explain this issue. There might be an issue with that. There might be. Uh, let's, let's go to, where should we go first? I'll explain it while I do this. We we're going to go to that place we, we weren't able to dive at at first. Oh, I think it's closer to Fuchsia City. I think it's closer to Fuchsia City. Eh. Sorry, I'm stumbling on my words a little bit, but... We might not be able to battle Red until we beat the Elite Four again. We might. Maybe. I'm not sure, though. But we're gonna try to explore Mount Silver first and see how everything goes. Anyway, oh my gosh. Do I have to go all the way around? Oh, what a waste of steps. That's unfortunate. Let's go around. Over here, down here. There we go. Let's go down here. You don't want to see, uh, since we have access to dive and Latios learns it, Latios learns it, we might as well see what's in that place that we weren't able to dive in. 
because why not waste the, all the juicy fun we can have in this game? Nope, this is the gym. I'm pretty sure it's over here, right? Where are, the, where are those seafoam islands? Cinnabar Island. I think it's right here. Yep, I think it's over here. Let's run up here, over here, down here. Yeah, right here. Right here's the spot. You wanna dive to the bottom? EJ, you dive! The Undersea Cavern. One epic. Ooh, this is so epic. I'm literally Aquaman right now. I'm literally the god of the sea. Is the trident of Poseidon in here? Huh? The Undersea Is there... Where's the... I'm looking for that trident. You don't test me, boy. It's over here. I can't get over here. Let's try... Let's travel over here. I can surf in here. Wow, that's cool. I'm surfing underwater. V very interesting, Liquid Crystal. Very interesting. Let's go down over here. Let's go up here. Let's go in here. Let's go over here. This is really cool, actually. These, these, the creators of this game put so much effort into this game, which I really love. The effect wore off. Yeah. Let's go over here. Down here. We're gonna round town, and let's go out here. Let's keep going up here, and there's a there's people down here. Hey, I remember you from the Ilix Forest. I have, I haven't seen any other trainers down here. It must be because you can't get any Wi-Fi down here. Colon P. Anyways, battle. Oh um, my trainer John, you were in the Ilix Forest, dude. Oh, I didn't heal on my Pokemon. Damn, I should have done that. You go for Ember. You go for Ember, really. Oh, dude, 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 Swellow. Ooh, Swallow's a, a pretty good mod, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, one hit KO City out here. Goodbye, Trainer John. No hardcore dancing in the living room. Wow, you're a pretty interesting trainer, man. I'll give you that. Ooh, a crater. Are we gonna find Deoxys in here? Wait, wait, what's that? Oh, no, that's another crater. False alarm. False alarm. What's over here? We might as well explore this, because next episode we're gonna go to Mount Silver, and yeah over here nothing much blah 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 let's go over here man this is a long and tedious what well, i wonder what what's in here though i i'm very i think it's another legendary but i'm not sure which one i i i uh, so i have a feeling that's another legendary i just I have this like gut feeling let's go over here surf around here let's go down the waterfall let's go in the rapids and let's go over here man this is this is very kind of a little, little bit trippy over here is very confusing up up da, 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 over here up right down right down right up then and there we go undersea cavern let's go up here and is there any pokemon here or did it was this a huge waste of time Oh, I really want to explore more, but I think this is getting boring. Give me a second. All right, I'm back. I'm pretty sure all that stuff, I looked it up. I'm pretty sure a bunch of this stuff is like after you beat Red, I'm pretty sure. But we're going to end it after, we're going to end this Nuzlocke after I beat Red. So, yeah. Thank you guys very much for watching. It really means a lot to me. Question of the day, who is your favorite? What was the question of the day again? I honestly forgot what I answered. Uh, oh, yeah, if you were to pick a type, a new type, what would you choose? A lot of people would choose sound type. I thought that was going to be a type, but like, they never did it. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and with that all said, peace out.